and let's uh, see where the other games in the series are. <coughs> okay, we're the only 3-0, uh, all the rest are 2 ones. So we'll get ready for game number four. So uh, so far, three games, three wins. So let's see if we can sweep this series and move on to the Western semi-finals. zone. Scooped up along the wall by McCabe. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Here's a short pass to Palmieri. LA is in transition. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Arizona's got a hold of it against the wall. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. LA's got the puck in their own end. An easy save by Dell. Takes the feed. Fires it into the offensive zone. LA's got a hold of it along the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Maintains possession. Moves it to Gibson. And it comes up with the save. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. We've still got zeros on the board. LA's won the draw and they'll go to work. Wow. Scores! Kyle Palmieri delivers. The defensive team can't get control of the puck off this face-off. It ends up into the shooter's hands, and he beats the goaltender. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Gets the puck over to Dowdy. LA is moving it along the wing. Snaps it on net. Denies it in front. Gibson's got the puck from the back end. Blistering shot and a great save. Whistle blown as that's redirected into the crowd. The Kings have had way more chances offensively, and as a result, they're leading in this one.
The rookie's been a big part of this dominating <coughs> portion of the game. They've been all over the opposition, and the coach is reminding them, don't take a step back. Keep pushing the pace. They've been like a pack of Wolverines out there on the ice to this point. The centermen glide into position. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Arizona's looking to break out. Return pass. The Coyotes played along the wing. And now it's over to Garland. And they fail to go tape to tape. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Great balance as he scoops it back up. Jostled off the puck. Quick pass to Bertuzzi. Hangs onto the puck. And there's the save. Los Angeles has it near the wall. The Kings move the puck in the defensive zone. Quick feed to Spiza. Garland's gaining momentum. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Here's a chance. From in close. Denies him. Quick's right on top of that chance. Great A spot. Great A save. Past the halfway mark of this period, Los Angeles is in the driver's seat. They lead it 2-1 in what has been a very spirited affair. Kopitar's won a big draw on their own end. Scrum ensues along the boards. Taken along the wall by Kessel. The Kings take over on possession. Kopitar's moving it ahead. Here they are on the attack. He scores! They make it another! They don't slow down. You get one, you get two. This goal played out on the odd man rush. They got out into the open ice, moved the puck. Well, we have a moment. Let's get back down to Ray Ferraro between the benches. Well, you can always tell when you've done a good job if the coach gives you a quick tap on the shoulder. The rookie has played really well and has responded to what the coach has wanted from him tonight. LA's now doubled their lead here in the first. By staying on the play, James has been the key for them. They've been aggressive. They've forechecked, and when they get a chance, they haven't missed. And he slides it quickly to McCabe. The Kings take it along the wall. Fails to find the open man. Los Angeles gains the zone. Picked up along the wall by Kopitar. Stays with it. Moves it quickly over to Palmieri. Stones him with the blocker. Kopitar's point streak has been a thing to behold. You start to get superstitious on a run. You do everything the same, you wear the same suit all the time. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Good hit to knock the puck loose. Goes right to the crease, and that goes wide. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. Well, that'll do it for period number one. Opportunities at both ends of the ice create a little bit of offense. Fun start here. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Second period set to go. The Kings win possession here as we open up the period, and that power play is still intact. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a reaction. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Off the glass and out of the zone. Consider that a win for the penalty killers for now. You bet it is. Now they can get a change, get some fresh people on the ice. LA's on the attack. Right in front with the shot, and that's blocked away. Los Angeles skins a hold of the puck against the boards. Big save in front. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. And now that's picked up by the defense. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. The Kings have it against the wall. Here's a short pass to Kopitar. LA's got the puck against the half wall. Here's a shot, and that's blocked. Moves it to Palmieri. Whoa! Scores! You get one, you get hungry for a second one. Even if you're not a goal scorer, you get that early. Now you want to hunt for a second goal. Ray, you're between the benches. Are you picking up on any of this? 
Yeah, I, I thought a really good reminder here from the coach to his youngest player is that you're at a point in the game where safety is better than a creative play. Make the right play the smart play. Keep the puck in front of you. Kopitar is one possession. The Kings looking against the half wall. Stopped by the goaltender. Dell's played poorly. The forwards and defensemen have played poorly. You can wrap a bowl around this one, James, and package it up. That's a bad night. The Coyotes get a hold of the puck along the boards. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Quick pass to Schmaltz and makes the save. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Side to bench. Sends it over to McCabe. The Kings have been putting lots of shots on net and have been rewarded for their efforts. Kopitar's won the draw. Picked up along the boards by Barry. Arizona's got the puck shorthanded. Doughty's last stick's in the garbage dump. He had to go get a new one. Comes up with the stop. Los Angeles was preaching pucks on net at the morning skate earlier today, and they've executed that game plan, which is why they lead here in the second. Now a quick pass to Saad, and that one's broken up. A shot, and that one's turned away. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, LA's got a 5-1 lead. They've been on cruise control all night. Puck scooped up by Gibson. Just wide. Stopped with ease. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Hammers it on net. Comes up with a stop. Coyotes win it in the defensive zone. Quick pass to Fisher. Arizona's got it along the wall. Couldn't connect on that pass. Los Angeles plays it along the wall. The Coyotes will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Fisher's got it against the boards. Los Angeles has it in their own zone. Sends it over to Gibson. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. And now he moves it quickly to Kempe. Taken by Kopitar. He scores! That's the hat trick! Little tweak to the crowd here on the road as he gets in third. An outstanding game so far. The power play takes advantage of that extra man nicely. They move the puck around and set up a shot. But then they have traffic in front of the net making the goaltender really work to see it. Los Angeles has continued this offensive onslaught. We still got half a game to play here, Razor. That's a shame for the opponent, too. They're not able to keep up at any level tonight. This is a laugher at this point. The Kings gain control of the puck against the wall. We'll get a face-off, and some lucky fan gets a memory of a lifetime. Los Angeles up big here in this second period. Their offense has been going right from the start. Arizona's won the draw. Handles the puck. To the front. Arizona's got the puck now. Denies him with oh, the save. Well. Good job he got that one. Eppen Larson's one of their only hopes to get back in the game. Their deficit is so large, they're going to need a lot to go right. The Kings take possession off the faceoff. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. LA's message going into this one when we talked to them at the morning skate was to get a lot of pucks on net. They've done just that, and they lead as a result. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Quick feed to Gibson. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Looks to set up at the point now. Circles back to center ice. Manages to hang on. 
trying to get back on the attack now. Los Angeles probably doesn't even need to rest in this second intermission based on how they have looked so far tonight up big. The Kings take possession off the faceoff. Musa quickly over to Gibson. And that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. The Coyotes move to the offensive zone. Shot in front. Oh, just yeah. missed. James, this really frustrates a player. You work so hard to get into this position, and you just miss the net. Uh, this coming from a guy who's got 400 plus frames, right? Los Angeles has turned good defense into offense. Plenty of scoring opportunities, and they lead here late in the second. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Here's a short pass to Gibson. Takes the puck at the point. Out front. Scores. Los Angeles has only added to their lead. Is there a danger of just getting complacent here now late in the second? Yeah, because you get sloppy. You're up by so much. If you make a mistake, it doesn't stress you out so much. Pretty soon, you can give away a couple of quick ones and change the complexion of this game. The Coyotes gain possession along the wall. Slides it over to Bertuzzi. Well, the ice has sure looked tilted after 40 minutes of play as the second period comes to an end. Don't go anywhere. Third period is coming up, and it's coming up next. <laughs> so let's get this uh, third period, hopefully final period done. And move on to the next round. Well, this has been an absolute blowout through the first two periods as we get underway here in the third. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? The Kings don't have to score anymore. This is such a comfortable lead. Just make sure that they protect the puck and play this thing right to the end. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Moves it to Kessel. Along the half wall with the puck. Gets in front of it. Quick's got the puck, and he elects to hang on for a stoppage and play. Now we're in the third period, James. It's pretty safe to say he's been on top of his game tonight. Not much has given him a problem. The Kings win the draw. Through center along the wing. That pass goes a little sideways. The Coyotes take it across the line. Quick pass to Schmaltz. Solid check to slow him down. His reflexes on display tonight. The Kings are on cruise control here in this third period, leading big. Kopitar's won it in their own end. The Kings have it now. LA's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Here they come up along the wing. Pass across to Kessel. With possession along the wall. Wrist one in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Quick's read the situation, and he's just going to let it breathe here, Ray. Well, every once in a while, the goalie will get a sense that the guys are starting to run around. He's been on top of it tonight. Been an excellent game. Quick feed to Gibson. Slides the puck across to Palmieri. And that's broken up. Arizona's got the puck in the defensive end. Ekman Larson's got it along the boards. Puts it up front. Here's a chance. And finally, they respond with a goal. They just haven't been able to get anything going. And the more they try to score, the more they give up more defensively. They've given up a boatload of goals. The Coyotes still have a lot of catching up to do, but they have something to build on now. Yeah, they do. And I think what they can look forward to is the buzzer is closer to the end of the game. Oh, you went there, huh? Arizona's got control of it now from their own end. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. 
Castle's hungry for that third one. He's got two. He took that quick little pass. Now he's a dangerous player. Los Angeles has been impressive to watch tonight. Numerous scoring opportunities, and they have converted on most of them. Kopitar's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Arizona's got the puck along the boards. From the slot, denies him with the blocker. What a stop by Quick. Get that slop out of here. He makes the stop, and there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Quick's right on top of this scoring chance. Nowhere for the puck to go. LA's got the edge in the shot department, a big reason why they lead here in this third period. And now it's grabbed by McCabe. Los Angeles moves ahead with the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Dismiss that chance. Across the line from center. From the slot, fires away. Oh, what a blocker stop by Quick. Here's an opportunity in front of the net. Makes the save. Puck picked up by Doughty. Los Angeles with possession in their own zone. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Here's a shot. How did he stop that one? Scrum along the boards. And it's freed up over to his teammate with a nice kick pass. Denies him on the slapper. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Pitlick's won the face-off. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Delayed penalty coming up here by the official. Gilles Levesque blows the whistle, and someone is off to the box. The Kings are getting two minutes for elbowing. You're on the receiving end of this. You're not very happy. That's a penalty all day long. Pretty easy call to make. At least it runs some time off the clock. The Coyotes can't convert on the power play. Both sides are back to even strength. Too passive, not aggressive enough. The puck gets moved around the outside of the penalty killers. Really doesn't become a dangerous power play. Moves it quickly over to Kessel. And just hitting the final minute now in regulation of this blowout. It scores! Uh, this is a different level here. You get into your first playoffs and you're able to get on the board. The Coyotes still have a lot of catching up to do, but they have something to build on now. Yeah, they do, and I think what they can look forward to is the buzzer is closer to the end of the game. Oh, you went there, huh? Here's a blast! Turns him away! Puck grab by Kessel. From center, they get into the attacking area. Takes the pass. Paul Marys moving the puck through his own zone. Smart defensive play there. Keller's got it along the wing. Moves the puck. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Arizona's gained possession along the boards. Los Angeles has it behind the net. Slides it quickly to Gibson with authority. Receives the pass. Slides it across. And as the dying seconds. That's the game, away, and that's the series. They exhale as they're moving on to the next round. Is this more about what they did or what their opposition didn't do here with the sweep? This looked like the opposition could have done whatever they wanted, and it just wasn't going to be good enough. That's a dominant series win. Very dumb. accomplished at one end of the ice and a long offseason looming for the other offseason starts now you go through this handshake line it is all over you try so hard and you come up empty and that'll do it for Ray Ferraro I'm James Sabalski thank you
And they're moving on with the series win. And, you know, congratulations. But they were the better team in the series. And I think the kids got to be breathing easier with those comments to say, you know, earlier in the series, you're up 2 nothing, and you're going, yeah, we like where we're at. We're going to win this thing. And uh, I would say, I, from what I was told, the coaching staff didn't love those comments publicly. But you know what? Hey, they delivered. The team delivered. He was part of the process as well and they're moving on. So props to them to back up the words from a kid that maybe made some people uncomfortable. All right, still to come here on the show, we look at some of the other stories. And I will say this, I wanna bring this back to the rookie here for a second, because I think some people seem to be a little outraged morally. Yes, we all get a little self-righteous on social media, don't we? But the kid saying, hey, look, we're gonna sweep this team, we're gonna deliver, and people seem to not like what he was saying. Uh, and they did it, mission accomplished. So he kind of has that sort of bragging rights that I told you so. Hey, if you're gonna talk it, you might as well bring it. Don't sing it, bring it. And they certainly did. And they're moving on as they complete the sweep. We're moving on as well here on the show. We'll hear from so both a sides. a quick look, see how the rest of the playoff series are going. Ooh, Tampa are one game away from elimination. In fact, I think I'm going to leave the YouTube video here. So if you are watching on YouTube, uh, thanks for watching. You can watch me live on twitch.tv forward slash gibbo42. And if you want to see when I'll be going live, you can follow me on my Twitter, which is at gibbo42gaming. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Uh, see you later, guys. Okay, if you're here on Twitch, uh, we'll fast forward the rest of this series. Let's find out who we've got in the next round. I might also look to see if we've got anyone we can raid. <coughs> just oh we're just waiting on one more and commentators curse from my first video uh, from the start of this uh, stream Tampa Bay are out so we've got Tampa Bay Montreal Toronto New Jersey Colorado Nashville we're just waiting on Vancouver and Edmonton for the last uh, playoff place. And we've got the Canucks. All right, wrong thing. Let's uh, quickly save. And that's going to do it for this stream, uh, possibly last stream for me this week. Uh, thanks for watching. If you want to see when I'll be going live, uh, once again, just uh, follow me on Twitter at Gibbo42 underscore Twitch. No, it's not. It's Gibbo42 Gaming. I keep forgetting I've changed the uh, Twitter handle. Yeah, so I'm not sure when the next stream's going to be. I don't think it's going to be this week. Maybe sometime early next week. So, um, thanks for watching. I will hopefully see you next week when we uh, take on the Vancouver Canucks in the uh, Western Semi-Finals. See you later, guys.